great job on the new RAV4. Everyone at Toyota USA appreciates your Genji Gimbutsu dedication to the North American market. Well, before I get started on RAV4 today, I have to tell you a quick little story about the last time we were here at the Four Seasons, this beautiful property. It was back in May of 07 for the preview of the 2008 Highlander. At the time, my friend Bob Carter, who most of you know, was the head of the Toyota division, and he was really looking forward to getting up and presenting the new Highlander, which had a hybrid for the first time. So picture this, if you will. It's still dark in his room. Bob's getting out of bed, getting ready for his big presentation. He puts his feet on the floor, and he steps on something, and he reaches down. He thinks it's a piece of paper or a leaf. And to his surprise, it was a scorpion. And it stung him pretty good. So how's that for a wake-up call? But you know Bob, he's a tough guy, so he got through it and made his remarks. And, and really, with a little extra motivation from that, he helped lead the uh, new Highlander to 100,000 plus sales that year. And if you're anything like me, you've been looking around the corner here, and you're staying the night to see if there's any scorpions in my room. But uh, it's a great property. I'm sure it's not going to happen to us, but we sure have had some fun with him. So let's get back to the RAV4. I'm sure, I'm sure you know it's been a significant vehicle for Toyota since its inception in 1994 as the world's first crossover SUV. We introduced RAV4 to the U.S. market in 1995. And since then, we've sold more than 1.7 million units, with 80% still on the road today. A true testament to its quality and durability. It eventually led to the Highlander midsize crossover, and the industry has followed with about 45 crossover SUVs that are on the market today. As a matter of fact, with a few exceptions, like our Forerunner and FJ Cruiser, most compact and mid-sized SUVs today are crossovers. Since 1995, three progressive generations have strengthened RAV4's pedigree with new standards in the segment it created. It's always led the way, satisfying customers in the areas of QDR, versatility, and functionality, attributes that have always been in Toyota's DNA. And it will continue to offer the safety, features, and capability that young families and couples want. I see RAVs all the time at parks and at beaches and hiking trails and mountain resorts, taking people and their gear where they need to go. Toyota recently introduced a new tagline, Let's Go Places, and the 2013 RAV4 will take people to a variety of destinations with dynamic styling, a spacious premium interior, and new onboard technologies our customers have asked for. Last month, we launched a new app on our Facebook page called RAV4 Adventures, where owners are sharing all the places they've been with their RAV4s. As a matter, as a matter of fact, the new RAV4 will help people go places all over the world. In addition to the U.S., it will be sold in more than 150 countries and regions around the world, including Australia and many in Europe. For 2013, new contemporary styling creates the most visually dynamic RAV4 ever. And it's a continuation of Akio Toyota's direction for more emotionally engaging products, like the Scion FRS and the all-new Avalon. Thanks to Saiki-san's triathlete inspiration, it has agile, sporty character and a dynamic silhouette. The front fascia projects a bolder, more aggressive look one design change you'll notice right away is that we relocated the rear-mounted spare tire underneath the cargo area. This enables us to have a new rear lift gate instead of a side-mounted door to make loading and unloading much easier for our customers. The new exterior design, including an integrated rear spoiler, provides improved aerodynamics for better fuel efficiency. Toyota's Calthe Design Studio in Southern California contributed to the interior styling, which is sporty and refined, providing a spacious atmosphere. The 2013 RAV4 will continue to offer customers a choice of front or all-wheel drive. And listen to this, all-wheel drive models will be the first Toyotas equipped with dynamic torque control for better traction. There's also a new six-speed automatic transmission for improved fuel economy and performance. Paired exclusively with our 2.5 liter four-cylinder engine, it will provide smooth, 
and efficient performance for a variety of driving conditions. The previous V6 option will be discontinued to satisfy compact SUV customers who are demanding more fuel efficiency, and a mid-sized crossover like Highlander will satisfy those who need more power. With the four-cylinder engine, six-speed automatic, and aerodynamic improvements, the 2013 RAV4 will have an EPA estimated rating of 31 miles per gallon on the highway, up from 28 miles per gallon for the 2012 model. Here are just a few more features that help place the new RAV4 ahead of our competition. Standard backup camera viewed through a 6.1 inch display audio screen, adjustable power lift gate, glass leading 73.4 cubic feet of cargo volume, and a class leading eight standard airbags. In just a few minutes, Jeff Halsey from the University of Toyota will explain these and other features in more detail. The small SUV market has grown dramatically over the last 12 years. With new model redesigns and changing consumer preferences, it continues to evolve and differentiate itself from the other SUV segments. It has increased from just 10 models 12 years ago to about 25 today. As a result of this growth, segment sales have tripled since 2000 and now account for nearly 13% of the total light vehicle market. We think the segment will continue to expand because more and more consumers see small SUVs as practical, versatile, capable, dependable, and economical. Overall, they rank reliability and value for the money as their top purchase considerations, two critical areas where the new RAV4 will excel. More than 30 years ago, Toyota had a slogan, you asked for it and you got it. And it's just as true today as it was then. Like Saiki-san, we spent a lot of time talking to consumers to understand their desires in a small SUV. Here's what they asked for so that they could go places in comfort and style. Standard features and amenities, not a stripped down price leader. A choice of models and features, but not as many choices as a menu at a Chinese restaurant. A vehicle they can enjoy with family and friends. And good value with style and technology that will help make their busy lives easier and safer. Again, the new RAV4 will meet these needs and more. And buying a new RAV4 will be a lot easier because we reduced the ordering complexity as consumers requested. It now comes in three grades, LE, XLE, and Limited, each offering great standard features and excellent value. I mentioned earlier that the new RAV4 will deliver value for the money. To prove this point, I have some pricing information for you here today, which is embargoed until December 18th, as Greg mentioned. Let's begin with the front-wheel drive model. The LE is not a base grade vehicle. It will have more standard equipment than most of the competition, including the features customers demand, like rear backup camera, privacy glass, 17-inch wheels with full covers, color-keyed rear spoiler, and a 6.1-inch display audio unit. LE will start at 23.3, a real value, especially when you consider competitive vehicles with that level of equipment would cost thousands more. We think the XLE will be our volume leader because it's aimed right at the heart of the market. It will have more than $2,000 worth of standard equipment, yet cost only about a thousand more than the LE. It really reflects the value for the money consumers desire including 17-inch alloy wheels, dual-zone automatic climate control, power sliding moonroof, fog lamps, and sport seats. Starting at 24,290, the only option on XLE is navigation with Intune, which brings the MSRP to 25,320, considerably less than Escape or CRV with navigation. Rounding out the lineup is the limited grade, which starts at $27,010 and includes standard 
Features like 18-inch alloy wheels, adjustable power liftgate, premium soft tech seating, power driver seat with memory, and heated front seats. Available options include a blind spot monitor with cross-traffic alert, navigation with Entune, and a premium JBL audio system. All-wheel drive is available on all three grades at a $1,400 premium. Prices are LE 24-7, XLE 25-690, and limited at 28-410. All RAV4s will have standard Toyota Care, which provides two years of complimentary maintenance and 24-hour roadside assistance. When the new RAV4 goes on sale in January, it will offer great value for a wide range of buyers, providing unique standard features in this growing segment. We expect LE will account for about 30% of sales, XLE about 40%, and the remaining about 30% in limited. All-wheel drive will make up approximately two-thirds of our total RAV4 sales, pretty similar to the current generation today. The 2013 RAV4 will appeal to our current owners but will also draw buyers from other brands with its styling, features, and value. Our objective is to sell about 200,000 units in the, 200, in the 2013 calendar year. Most of these vehicles will be manufactured at our award-winning Woodstock plant in Ontario, Canada. In the coming months, our RAV4 marketing campaign will begin with TV, interactive and print in the general market, and we will also reach out to Hispanic and African American consumers. We will target singles and couples in their 30s and 40s, many with young children. It all started 16 years ago when Toyota had a vision for a vehicle that would change the way people think of SUVs. And now, the fourth generation RAV4 will let our customers go places they've never gone before with all the style, comfort, features, and technology they could possibly imagine. The journey starts today, and I'm glad you're along for the ride.